Transylvania. Maybe I can understand that, but why would David want to go to Gloucester on Christmas? Probably for reasons he doesn't want us to know. Probably has something to do with it. Fatal disease he's faking. He's not faking. No. And Santa's stuck in the chimney, but he'll be here any minute. It's just one man's opinion, Amanda. You know what? If you guys are all going to start this again, no, no. I, I... Merry Christmas! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Mom! Come on in, come on in, join the party. Mom, 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 Mom. Oh, yes, 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 I know. Oh, yeah. Merry Christmas, everyone! Hey, Mama, Papa. Hey, Sam, how you doing, baby? Hey, I have to show you something. Come here, I have this little surprise. What hug, what hug? She was watching. Oh, dear. Hey there. You guys are bundled up. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was uh, rather chilly out yeah, there. Yeah, very chilly out <laughs> yeah. there. But it's uh, 84 in Florida. Oh, oh, now. When's the big move? As of next week, we will officially be residents of the Sunshine State. Huh? I say sunshine is highly overrated. Can't anybody talk you two into staying? I've already tried, Mom, but these two crazy kids are set on retirement. Oh. I mean, with Mert gone and the two of you moving, Petey's not around. Where's Petey? Oh, he's spending the holidays with old Palmer Scrooge off in Switzerland. Uh, he was supposed to come back for the new year, but now apparently he is smitten with a Swiss ski bunny. Something tells me that we're all going to be seeing a lot more of each other this winter. I mean, you, you'll call and you'll say you're flying down because you miss us. Aww. Actually, you'll all be wanting to work on your tans. <laughs> or tan men. Oh, I have the apricots. Excuse me. I need a hand with something. Apricots. There you go. Coming to give me my present? No, I just want to make sure my younger brother doesn't screw up the holidays. Screw up the holidays? Yeah, that's right. Screw up the holidays? First of all, I Buck can't up. Kind of Would wrap you give my head break? around Mom I know, it's a bummer, it's, okay, but I, I want you to take to one for the team. I else. Gloucester. I knew it. I think I, I don't want to talk about there, Gloucester. It's Christmas. Amanda something. is here, okay? I'm sorry. You're not going it anywhere. It is important. So is this. You walk out that door for any reason, you're going to be making a bad situation worse. Did I ask you for help? I can go there by no, myself. No, 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 no. I'm not going to go. And neither are you, what okay? If I'm able the to kids go have got an entire mountain full of presents. What I'm not going to miss for the world. And neither what is their uncle. What if I can uncle. prove that his whole six-month living well, is just Well, that would be crap. wonderful. So Merry Christmas. Just, Happy New Year. You want it? We should let it go. At this point, we don't have a choice. Oh, hi. Good to see you, my friend. Merry Christmas. Hi. Ruth, this is my wife, Marissa. Hi, oh. nice to meet you. Yes. Oh, wow, this deserves a hug, not a handshake. Oh. Well, it's, it's so good to see you looking happy, really. Oh, well, same here. I yeah. hear that you guys are moving to Florida. Yep. Congratulations, that's amazing. Uh, actually, it's a total bummer. Well, you're both welcome for a visit any time oh, you like. Oh, well, uh, bring extra sunblock for your head. Point me towards the gingerbread. I can smell it from there. <laughs> nice to meet you. Oh, bless you. Oh, that's... Why don't you... Yes? Stand over here with me. Walk this way? Yeah, walk this way. If I could... I, never, uh, I got you a little something. Oh. Yeah, no, I thought you'd be able to really? use it in the tropics. Yeah, yeah. Right, open it. It comes right open. Let's see. Ah. <laughs> well, it's a... Uh, it's it's uh, a joke. Pop. It's a joke. Okay. Yeah. Listen, <laughs> your real present is I want to fly you and Mom up here this summer to stay with us. Yeah. For a week, for a month, however long you want. I just want to make sure that as the little girls grow up, you know, that you're a part of their lives. Well, let's hope your brother will still be here, too. Why? Mm. Is Jake retiring, too? Well, I had a talk with him some time ago, and he said he quit his job and was leaving Pine Valley. Well, you know he changed his mind, right? Yes, I do know that. And let's hope he uh, keeps his mind changed that way. But, you know, somehow I was hoping that once uh, your mother and I were gone, that he would pick up the family reins, you know? That he would uh, pick up where I left off. Yeah. Keep an eye on everybody. But 
It seems he's not interested. Oh, no, come on, Dad. That's not the case. He's just been so miserable these last few months with this whole Hayward mess. Holding on to Amanda and Trevor is all he can handle right now. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Well, you're the man. I'm what? You're a, you're a very wonderful father. You've got a beautiful home. And I think you do a fine job keeping an eye on the Martin clan. <laughs> you know, it's funny you should say that. You mind if I ask your advice one last time? We got a tip about David Hayward. It was everything I could do not to hogtie Jake because he wanted to run out of here. But every instinct I have tells me to check it out. But I, I can't run out on the girl. Sounds to me like you'd be doing it for the girls. Why don't you just make your apologies only, huh? Yeah. The most important thing in the world is to protect those you love. Hey, little ones. You know what? I know a secret. There's a DVD machine upstairs in the bedroom. It's got something in it, ready to go on the telly. Really good show. Santa and his buddies or something. You guys want to see it? Yeah. Run up there. Beat it. Beat it. Beat it. Hey, I, uh, was a idiot. Last night. Don't. I'm the one that overreacted. Really? Because I didn't notice that if you did. I shouldn't have left with him, Jake. I know we decided not to let the holidays be about David, oh, but I couldn't help it. I just have this instinct. You, you have an instinct. You just want to sort of take care of everybody and smooth things over. I think you've been probably doing that since you were little with your mom. Making sure that uh, Janet didn't hurt anyone and maybe nobody would hurt Janet. Always feeling stuck in the middle. I get it. I just wanted everything to be okay all the time, right? Exactly. Whoa. Well, am I going to be mad at you because you have instincts? <laughs> Everybody has instincts. I, I got them. My instincts are on high alert with David. Are you kidding me? I mean, they're on high alert because he burned us, you know? And I just don't want to... I can't let that happen again. Tad's on high alert, too. He thinks he's convinced, actually, that David is faking this illness. Do you think that? I don't know if we'll ever really know. <laughs>